In today's day and age, it may feel like nowhere is safe anymore, with conflict almost everywhere you look. You may be wondering if there are any countries that are actually still considered safe. We're going to be looking at the safest countries to live in the world for 2024. It analyzes 163 countries and uses a mixture of quantitative and qualitative data relating to a country's societal safety and security, domestic and international conflict, and militarization. Number 8. Iceland The safest country in the world. Not only has Iceland become an incredibly popular tourist destination in recent years, but it's one of the safest places for tourists to visit and for people to live. Factors that likely contribute to this include low crime levels, some of the world's strictest gun control laws, despite high rates of gun ownership, and political stability. When it comes to crime, Iceland has a global crime index of 3.39, the third lowest on this list. Its homicide rate, meanwhile, is one of the lowest on this list at 0.3. It's no surprise that 85% of people in Iceland say that they feel safe walking alone at night. Number 7. Canada. Ranked 11th safest globally, owes its safety to multiple factors. With stringent law enforcement focusing on community engagement, its global crime index stands impressively low at 3.66, 20% below the U.S. Politically stable, Canada prioritizes conflict resolution and promotes multiculturalism since 1971, fostering diversity. Their robust social welfare system aims to uplift citizens, reducing poverty and enabling social mobility. This intentional design not only fosters productivity but also curbs crime rates within the country's borders. Number 6. Switzerland You probably won't be surprised that neutral Switzerland is on this list. In fact, Switzerland apparently hasn't been in a war since 1815, over 200 years ago. Switzerland not only prides itself on not getting involved in global conflict but also tries to reduce conflict at home. Crime-wise, Switzerland has a global crime index of 4.34 and a homicide rate of 0.3. Despite high rates of gun ownership amongst Swiss citizens, the country actually hasn't had a mass shooting in years. This may be partially due to strict gun control laws that limit who's allowed to own a gun. Number 5. Japan Which has a global crime index of 4.53, about 10% lower than the global crime index of the U.S., Furthermore, its homicide rate is only 0.2. Japan's low rate of violent crime is due largely to cultural factors. In other words, Japanese citizens are raised to have respect for the law and for following the rules of society. Its membership in prominent international organizations, including the UN, the Asian Development Bank, and the World Bank, may also contribute to Japan's stability. Number 4. Singapore after joining the Federation of Malaysia in 1963, Singapore became an independent nation in 1965. The country is known for a government that is hyper-strict when it comes to laws and regulation. You may have heard, for instance, that if you travel to Singapore, you can receive heavy fines or even jail time for chewing gum in public or littering. While these are definitely strict laws, and some have questioned whether these laws infringe on personal freedom and human rights, Singapore is safe. Its global crime index is the lowest on this list at 3.13. For instance, per capita GDP here is high, and the country has low rates of unemployment. Number 3, Austria, has a global crime index of 4 and an incredibly low homicide rate of 0.5, making violent crime here rare. Because of this, it's probably not surprising to you to hear that a full 86% of people who live in Austria say that they feel safe walking alone at night. Factors that contribute to the country's safety include its incredibly high standard of living and strong economy, both of which help reduce crime. The government is also stable, belonging to international groups including the UN, World Trade Organization, and EU, among others. Number 2. Ireland Ireland ranks second safest due to its remarkably low violent crime and domestic terrorism rates. In 2020, the country had only 71 homicides, a stark contrast to the U.S.'s 21,570. This trend continued with 53 homicides in 2021 and 69 in 2022. With a population of about 5 million, this reflects significantly low crime. The homicide rate stands at 0.5, 
and its global crime index at 4.9. Ireland's policy of military neutrality further contributes to its safety, avoiding participation in international conflicts. Number 1. Denmark Crime in Denmark is sparse. Denmark boasts low crime rates and a strong sense of safety. With a homicide rate of 0.5, 85% feel comfortable walking alone at night. Its global crime index stands at 3.86, influenced by robust welfare systems ensuring access to education and health care for all. This promotes social mobility and keeps crime rates low. Internationally, Denmark's stability is evident as a member of NATO, the EU, OECD, and OSCE, contributing to its safe environment. If you're wondering how the U.S. ranked on this list, it's listed as number 131 out of 163 countries on the Global Peace Index. The low rating is mostly due to a high prison population rate, high rates of weapon exports, and civil unrest. Thanks for watching everyone. If you liked this video, don't forget to hit the like button below and subscribe. See you in the next video.